Hey everybody, this is Melvin with Tech Running 24-7 and in today's video we want to show you how to change the navigation bar on your Galaxy S9 and S10. Now, I had a few people to uh, reach out to me and say that after an update, their navigation bar was gone and all they have was these three dashes and they didn't know what that represented. Well, those three dashes represent full gestures on your Galaxy S9 or S10 and so Three dashes still represent the button. So the far left is the recent apps, the middle is the home button, and the far right is the back button. And so what I would mean, what you would do is say, for instance, we went to this other page and we were trying to get back home, we just swipe up from there, the middle section where the home button would be, and it would take you home. Or, like we said, the right would be the back, and the left would be the recent apps button. Now, if you don't like those, we can show you how to switch it back. So to switch it back, you need to go over and hit your settings. And once you're in your settings, go ahead and slide down to where you will see advanced features. Open advanced features and slide all the way down to the bottom of where you will see navigation bar. Tap on that. And now you hit the navigation bar section. And as you can see here, it said navigation type. You can either have the navigation button or the full gestures. And so if you want to go back with the buttons, all you would do is tap here to highlight that. And if you notice, the buttons are automatically there. Your recent apps, your home, and your back button. Now, if you look a little further, though, uh, you can even switch size that you want to have your recent apps. So on your Galaxy S9 and S10, the uh, recent apps button are the three little lines. So you can have it traditionally on the left, or you can choose the selection here to put it on the right and which will switch your back button from the right to the left. So depending on which one you want to do. So you can just leave it like it is or switch it. So do me a favor in the comment section, leave me a comment to let me know which one do you, do you prefer. Do you prefer the navigation buttons or do you prefer the full gestures? So that's about it for our video for today. Hopefully we shared something that you can use and something that was beneficial. If so, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below and hit the bell icon too so you can be notified of new content as soon as we release it. And again, this is Melvin with Tech Ready 24-7, bringing you technology that's on the move. Thanks.